One of the most common questions we get from parents is why does their child's sporting progress slow down as they start to travel through the teenage years? And one of the biggest issues we do find in youth athlete development is the law of diminishing returns. And it's used across in many different industries, but within the sporting context, it means that as an athlete starts to develop through those teenage years, they get more and more exposure to their sport. They actually get less and less return from doing that sport. When they're young and they haven't been exposed to much of it, their development is rapid. But as they start to travel through the teenage years, they start to approach that ceiling and it's very hard to improve that development by just doing the sport. So as they approach that ceiling, it's really important to start to look externally as to how we can develop their athletic potential. And one of the key areas is through strength, power and muscular development because it's often something they don't get or at least can't get any more of once they reach the teenage years within their sport. So if they want to make the next level, if they want to try and improve in their sport, we need to try and find a way to overload their system through strength and power. And unfortunately, just doing the sport is not going to cut it. If you're one of those parents that are noticing that your child's athletic development is starting to slow as they reach their teenage years, and you haven't looked externally, in particular with strength and conditioning development, then this is one of the easiest ways to progress them to the next level. So if what I've just listed is all new to you, please click the link below and see how we do it here at Athletes Authority and develop our youth athletes into future champions.